Hello, I am your teacher, Gary Vernier. Welcome to Activate Your Grammar. Today, you are going to learn how to use the modal verbs would and should. Let's begin with what you already know, how to use the modal verbs would and should in Spanish. Here are some examples. Tú deberías descansar. You should rest. Ellas no deberían esperar. They should not wait. Yo compraría esos zapatos. I would buy those shoes. Nosotros no haríamos eso. We would not do that. Before you try the initial activity, let me give you one clue. The word would does not exist in Spanish. There is no translation or word for it. It is usually expressed in Spanish by adding IA to the end of the infinitive verb. For example, hablaría, would speak, comería, would eat, or viviría, would live. The video will now stop and you will have an activity to practice identifying when to use should or would in a sentence. Okay, hopefully from the Spanish examples you were able to figure out some of the different uses for should and would. Should is simply debería. The two most common uses of should are to express what is the ideal or best thing to do in a situation. For example, there should be more public hospitals in the city. And secondly, should is also used to give advice or suggestions. For example, you should eat healthier. Would, on the other hand, has many different uses. It is used for polite requests. For example, would you please pass me the salt? Would is also used to express a condition. For example, if the train had not been late, I would have arrived on time. Would is used to talk about habits or routine in the past. For example, when I lived in California, I would go to the beach every day. Remember, the word would cannot be translated into Spanish. It does not exist. So you have to learn and become familiar with how it is used in English. The video will now stop and you will have an activity to practice forming sentences in English with should and would. Congratulations! Now you know how to use would and should in English. I will see you back here again for the next lesson. Good luck!